Welcome back to another video. My name's Thomas Gelder. Let's suppose that you were able every night to dream any dream you want. Well, to something is going to happen to me that I don't know what it's going to be. Well, that was pretty great. Now, I know it's been a while, but I've been busy and I've been trying to think of new ideas and what stuff I can bring to you guys. First video we're going to learn is a music video effect. It's quite popular at the moment. It's where a freeze frame comes into shot and as it comes in, it pauses for two seconds and as the action's moving into the photo, it continues. It's very effective, it's very simple, um, but it looks cool. It looks like, eh, how did they do that? But to be honest, it's pretty simple. It's a few key in, a few key frames, and that's about it. That's the effect done. Less of the talking, more action. Let's get into the editing suite and see how I did it. So once we're in the editing suite, we've got our two clips. Our two clips are here, so I've got this and then I want it to transition it into this clip so I want it to transition about here so what I'm going to do is take a shot of the frame saving your pictures and drag that picture into the project and this image is what we're going to be keying out this is the effect so make sure you put the picture where the frame is what you're going to do is drag it along to the other clip, bring all this down to where it starts and then what you're going to do from here is just key out the person. Again, what I'm going to be doing is just a rough copy. Um, I suggest when you're doing this professionally and for a project, you take your time on it. But for today, I'm just going to be showing you a rough cut of how it's actually done. So once the keying done, as you can see, boom, it's going to continue from there. So what we want to do is make this zoom into this clip and then let it play from there. So how we're going to create the animation effect is go onto motion, click on position and scale. Also rotation if you want to make it do a 360 in. And then I'd suggest doing it by 10 frames. And then again, keyframe. To where it's meant to be and then go back to the original keyframes and pull it to a side so it's out of shot and what this then does is make it come in shot like this and then play from there so once we've done this animation effect we can also mess around with the rotation and make it do a 360. let's see how this looks see that just adds a little bit extra to it now to make it feel even more realistic, we can go to blur, add some directional blur, bring it to around 45, put the blur length to about 5, go to where it starts, make sure you keyframe the blur length once it gets to middle, so the first 5 frames, make sure you put the blur length up to about 8, just because it's in motion, and then once it's static, bring it back down to 0, because now it's where we want him to be. So now if we play that back, it looks pretty cool. Now what else I can do just to make it pop a little bit more is at the end, I reckon where three frames is, one, two, three. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go on channel and then go on invert. This will make him flash, just so it adds that little extra pop to the effect. There you go, it looks pretty cool. You can either use it or you haven't got to use it. I'm just giving you other ideas here. Like I said, it's a very cool music video effect. A lot of people are using this right now and a lot of people use it in a very creative style. This is just me showing you the basis of it. So from here, it's up to you guys what, what you want to do with it. You can get experimental, but now you know the basis of how to do the effect. Now that's it for this video. Um, if you want to learn anything or if you want to see me react to anything or try doing an effect, please let me know in the comments because the more you guys suggest things, the better it is for me. Um, and helps me come up with different ideas and different videos to do. So if you could do that, comment down below. It literally takes 20 seconds. Um, let me know what you guys like to see. Saying that, I'm gonna sign out. Make sure you follow my social medias, especially my Instagram. Um, make sure you subscribe, every little helps. And I'll see you guys next time. And I promise I'll try to be consistent. Comment down your footage. And as you can see, there we have it. That's the VHS look. 